Step into the enchanting world of Sri Lanka, where the age-old tradition of snake charming comes to life. A skilled snake charmer mesmerizes the crowd with a captivating show, featuring a majestic cobra in a woven basket. As the haunting melody of traditional music fills the air, the charmer's movements become a dance of ancient artistry and respect for these revered creatures. Fun fact, cobras aren't actually charmed by the music. They respond to the rhythmic movements of the charmer, showcasing the deep bond between human and snake. The cobra, often a spectacled cobra, Naja Naja, is known for its hooded display, a warning sign not to be taken lightly. Skilled snake charmers in India use a traditional instrument, the pungi or bean, passed down through generations. Watch as the charmer, with the sway of the pungi, entrances the cobra, creating a spellbinding harmony. Despite the snake's inability to hear, it responds to vibrations, following the charmer's motions. This ancient art form, deeply rooted in cultural heritage, showcases a unique bond between man and serpent. Meet the Indian Cobra, scientifically known as Naja Naja. This iconic serpent, with its distinctive hood and elegant markings, holds the esteemed title of being one of the big four venomous snakes in India. Now you might be wondering, how do snake charmers handle these potent creatures without facing dire consequences? The secret lies in the extraction of the snake's venom glands, a practice that traces its roots back through generations. While controversial, this method aims to reduce the snake's ability to inject venom during performances. However, it's crucial to note that despite these efforts, these snakes remain potentially dangerous. This age-old tradition raises ethical questions about the treatment of these majestic creatures. As we delve into the world of snake charming, we'll explore the intricate dance between humans and serpents, shedding light on the complexities and controversies surrounding this mesmerizing practice. As we venture deeper into the world of snake charming, it's essential to understand that the Indian cobra, aside from its venomous nature, plays a vital ecological role in maintaining the balance of local ecosystems. This species primarily preys on rodents, helping control their population and protect crops. The unique spectacle of snake charming is deeply rooted in cultural traditions, often traced back to ancient rituals and folklore. The mesmerizing dance performed by the snake charmer is not only an art form, but also a reflection of the rich cultural tapestry of India. Despite its cultural significance, it's essential to acknowledge the welfare of these creatures. Conservation efforts are increasingly focusing on promoting humane practices, encouraging the protection of both human performers and their serpentine counterparts. <laughs> 